Today we're going to cover issue 1170, flip gravity on jump is per actual jump. So it looks like if you can double jump, you can potentially cause yourself to flip upside down twice in a single jump. And it looks like it would be desired that this only occurs when you jump off of a floor rather than any time. This one should be pretty simple. So we're gonna look here in puser.c with p do jump, which is where all of the jump routine is held. And if we scroll down, we'll see there's a check if it's in a flip sector. Let's take that and move it out of there. And if you look at top of the function right here if you haven't jumped already so this will be a jump that occurs from the floor but there's some situations here where we're not jumping from the floor such as if you're being carried by something else whether it's a rope or if it's a terabyte so what we can do is check at the bottom here probably be the best place to do it if um, Let's check and make sure that the Z coordinate of the player is less than or equal to its floor. And only then will we potentially consider flipping the player. To test this too, let's also change our character abilities. And we'll just apply it here inside of the jump. So the first time we jump, we'll gain these, gain these abilities. Now that we've jumped once, we can jump as many times as we want. Let's give this a try. It looks like it's fixed. Well, almost. <laughs> it doesn't flip the second time because when you're flipped, you have to check if your top is on the ceiling Z, not just the floor Z. So let's go back to where we do this check. So now it should work when we jump from not just the floor, but also from the ceiling. Okay, here's our second try. Jump. Try doing a double jump. Nope. Only on the single jump coming off of the floor. Much better. Make sure we undo our test code. and we'll send our changes back. That's it. 
This was an easy one. <laughs>